Now to Espino in Portugal and the FIFA Beach Soccer World Cup. For the African island nation of Madagascar, it's been a first ever appearance on the world football stage. It's a great honour for the country, for the association and the players to participate in this World Cup. It's the first World Cup for us, so it's really an exceptional event. We received a great welcome at the hotel, the people, the food, everything was good. Although only recently introduced to Madagascar, beach soccer is a real emerging sport, thanks in part to its universal accessibility. You know, beach soccer is something of a poor man's sport. You don't need shoes and socks to play. You can play barefoot on the sand. All you need is a ball for the children to be able to have fun and then they can develop their talent. The goal of this team during the World Cup was to survive the group stage, where we were up against the 2013 World Cup semi-finalists Tahiti, the double world champions Russia and the South American runners-up Paraguay. Paraguay. That was ultimately too tough a task for the Madagascar team, but after three narrow defeats, there were still moments to treasure for all involved. This is the first time in my life that I've taken part in a World Cup. I've been dreaming about it for a long time, and I'm proud to be the one who scored the first ever goal for the Madagascan team. Truly a week to remember for Africa's kings of beach football.